Hi, I'm Sophie and welcome to my world. And in my world today, it's super sweet. Not because we have candy, but because we've got Frankie on board. So Frankie, get this. We are gonna turn candy into rings today. And what did you say about this ring when you put oh, it on? Yeah, this is what I imagine my wedding ring looking like, so. <laughs> well, that's, uh, that's many carrots, I'm sure. <laughs> Some sweet carrots there. So Frankie, we're gonna make this project and it's super fast, super quick, and you can make a whole bunch of them. As you can see, you can turn pretty much any kind of candy into a candy ring. For the project, we are gonna need scissors, candy, and pipe cleaner. Now I saw this um, in, on a website oh. <laughs> and they used one of these. They used this and it yeah. kind of does it, look yeah. like a diamond, a Hershey Kiss, right? Mm -hmm. So this is what they used. But let's you and I use your okay. Lindor. Okay, so choose two pipe cleaners. Let's I'm gonna choose red. Right. Great. And all we were gonna do is figure out where the halfway point is. So just kind of take it and just gently kind of Roll it up and find out where the halfway point is. And then okay. take the two. Yeah, right there. And then just take those two and cross them like the letter X. Okay. Now put your thumb and pinchy finger on one side, thumb and pinchy finger on the other side, and twist. And I like to twist it just you know, like two, three times to make sure that it's nice and together. Okay. How's that? Okay, now, that one's gonna be a little trickier. I will tell you that they're a little trickier, but let's do this one together and then we'll work on your Linder together. Okay. So, we take our... Hershey's Kiss, yeah. Yep, our Kiss, and we put the flat part right where Center. we made that X, right? Mm -hmm. And then we take one side and fold it down and the other side and fold it down, right? While holding it with our fingers. Then we bring this other side over and the other side over. So we're just kind of locking it in. See like that? Mm -hmm. And then we twist, twist it. Yeah. Right? We just give it a good twist. And then we pull the two legs apart. So I twist it about like two, three times, right? Mm -hmm. Put your finger out, whichever one you want. And this is, we're just gonna measure around your finger. And we want it to be a little bit loose, just so that when we twist it off, because we're gonna twist it right here like that. Once we twist it, you want to make sure it fits again, so try that on. How's that? Perfect fit. Cool. So now with these extra pieces, what we're going to do is just bring them up and wrap them around. Mm. Now, <clears throat> you can, if you want to, just cut them off. But the only reason I don't like to do that is because you get, you know how they're pointy mm -hmm. at the very end? And when it's pointy at the very end like that, it can sort of hurt your fingers. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So we're just going to pull it up again and wrap it around. So let's do yours. Okay. And I'm going to let you primarily do most of the work, but the linder is a little bit tricky because it's round. This is kind of actually nice and easy yeah. because of the shape. Mm -hmm. It's it's pretty <clears throat> it, it kind of loans itself yeah. to being turned into a, a ring. Okay, so let's take this and you put it in there like that. So start with one side. So what I learned with the linders is what you want to do is start with one side and twist it. That's it, and twist it really tight. That's it. Yeah, exactly. Good, and now take the other side and bring it up, and we can get that out of your way. And twist that really good. Great. Excellent, now pull those two sides off. Now you can size it cool. to your finger. Okay, what do you think, right about there? Mm -hmm. Okay, pull your finger out. Okay, and I'm gonna give this back to you, and you okay. can twist it. Great. And now Pull take those up. up on the side and attach them around the top and you got it. So now there's a way that you can make lots and lots and lots of sweet rings for all of your friends. Now here's the thing, you can use these for Mother's Day, you could use them for, we were talking about all kinds of things, Secretary's Day. You were saying that we could make one of these into Dumbledore's ring, right? Yeah, <laughs> we could. You could make it into the Dumbledore, what was it? Um, Oh, what's the name, the name, the name, it's, um, oh, it's Tom Riddle's Mal Marvolo, Mar Marvolo's Mar ring. Yeah. You could turn it into Marvolo's ring. Mar but it would be a little sweeter than the actual ring. Yeah. 
So for more fun ideas that are edible, come and check us out, sophie-world.com. <laughs> Ooh, hey, you did a great job. Yummy. That's beautiful. Yummy. <laughs>